I suppose this is something to do with Guernsey. Because huh. it is a bit bunker-like, isn't it? So was, what, what, tell me about this painting then, when you did it originally. Can you remember? The Norman Conquest. I can't. But look, that is a bit like a Norman helmet, isn't it? You know, when mm. they have those big funny steel helmets. What, and what what is the paint? Describe the painting to well, me. Well, obviously it's this big yellow, and this you see, this is like based on some of those German planes from the the First World War and things. You know, with these funny little veins and things. Ah, you know. right. Just seemed quite logical to do that. And then this is going to be the landscape. These little rocks put on air. Because it, it sort of looks like a um, submarine coming up in the background almost. Uh, no, that is a tower. A that tower. Is, yes, do you see? Look, mm. you know, you can see all the like a great big copper steel tower. Mm. Yeah. So how how mm. did you choose the colours then? I mean, why did was that? I good? haven't the vaguest idea. Mm. And this strange gantry ship going across. Yeah. Pure instinct, you know. And mm. sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. Like that really works, doesn't it? The yellow and the black with that in there. Yeah. And it's all very sympathetic. So um, it's very strange. It's when you when you just do it by instinct, it always works the best. Mm. So you just go with the colour combination yeah, that, that I, I, sort it of could comes. Be anything, yes. Obviously, some colours are much more sympathetic than others. You know, there we go. These little things. Yeah.